guys, I wanted to mention this in my favourites video, but my favourites video was so long I had to cut out the part where I mentioned this. Um, ages ago I meant to make this video and I never got around to it, like two or three months ago. Um, and I thought, right, while well, I had the time and Milo's still napping, I'm going to do it. The video is going to be about these. Now, these effectively are the goodie spin pins, but I bought them from Primark. I don't know if you can still buy them. I bought them one week, put them on my hair, was completely addicted, absolutely love them. So easy to put your hair up and it seems like um, it kind of damages your hair less than um, hair bands that you might put in your hair. No hair comes out on these, especially right now. If I put anything in my hair, when I take it out, it's covered in hair because I'm losing so much um, post-pregnancy. But these, it's not the same problem that I have at all. Uh, so this seems like a perfect time to talk about it. Uh, basically, I bought them for a pound, two for a pound from Primark. I went back to find some more, went to several different Primarks, couldn't find them anywhere. The only thing that I can think, I mean, other than them being really, really popular if they suddenly were, is that they weren't, like, they were actually copyrighted by Goody, because they're like five pounds something in boots from Goody. I would pay five pounds something for them, but the problem with me is I generally lose things. This is absolutely incredible that I still have both of these. Um, but if I had to repurchase them, I would repurchase full price. Um, from the actual Goody brand, but if you find them in Primark, buy loads of them because I cannot find them anywhere. Anyway, basically the, the premise of these is that you can tie your hair up by spinning these into your hair. I'm going to show you some ways that you can do it. So generally the more hair you have, the easier these are to use. Um, so I wouldn't say that if you've got really, really thick hair, don't use them. You might need more than two pins, I'm not sure. Um, but for an example, I actually saw It's Judy Time do a video on these and she's got really long, thick hair and they've worked really well for her. I think the more, more hair you've got, the more invisible the pins are and that's kind of the point of them. But I absolutely love them. It's so easy to put your hair up. You can lie down, you can't feel them. Um, and it just, I don't know, it just makes it so easy to make your hair look a little bit neater and, I don't know, just more polished than just having a hair band in. So yeah, I absolutely love them. I will use them all the time and if I can find some more at that price, I'll definitely buy some more. If I lose these, I will be repurchased in the Goody brand ones. So let me know if you've tried these yourself, if you love them as much as I do. Um, I don't see how you couldn't if you tried them because they're amazing. If you've got very, very thin hair, I would say you'd probably have to have quite long hair to use them, but I'd be really interested to see if you have got thin hair and uh, kind of my length and you've been able to make them work. Um, so leave me a comment and let me know. But I just really, really want to make a video and tell you how much I love them. So if you see them in Primark, snap them up because they are really, really good. And a pound for two is a really good price. Um, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, check out my other videos and my links below. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.